Well, the regular season's over for the 23rd-ranked Cougars, who wrapped it up today against the Huskies. Well, it didn't come without some drama. Senior night for Robbie Cowgill and four others. Emotional indeed. Cougs building a lead late in the second half. Pat Weaver, the long jumper. Cougs up six and in control. But the Huskies come roaring back. John Brockman, another big game. 17 points, 11 boards. Huskies up four with under two to go. 15 seconds. Cougs down two. Robbie Cowgill, the huge bucket. The hoop and harm, but he missed the free throw. So we're all tied up. Huskies with a chance to win. Kyle Weaver, the steal, the floater. Not going to fall. We are going to overtime. Under 10 seconds left in OT. Taylor Rochester misses the three, but Cowgill's there for cleanup duty. We're all tied up. And guess what? We're headed to a double overtime. Cougs build a lead there. Aaron Baines, the jam and he's foul. Cougs with a three-point lead late, but the Huskies have one last chance to tie it. Ryan Appleby off the mark. Cougs win it by three in double overtime. Now seven in a row over the Dogs, their longest win streak in the series. That's the last home game for the seniors, and they say this one is one of the sweetest of their careers. You know, with all the emotions in the air, you know, because it's senior night and, uh, you know, definitely made it more exciting that we're playing UW. So, I mean, out of all those games, I think this was a pretty exciting one. Next up, the Pac-10 tournament, and here are the seedings for that one. With the win, Cougars lock up the three seed, holding that tie over a tiebreaker over USC. Trojans and Sun Devils are four and five. Earning the six seed is Oregon. Who will be the Oregon's, uh, the Cougars' opponent in the opening round on Thursday? So it'll be the Cougs and Ducks on Thursday. Huskies wrap up the eighth seed, and no surprise, Oregon State bringing in the rear. Today they set a record going 0-18 in league play.